Okay, YouTubers, this is my solar panel array that I put together. These are five 240 watt sharp solar panels that I got on eBay. That's a 1200 watt configuration. Pole mount, putting in 1200 watts into my battery bank. And we'll go in here and look at my setup. This is my washroom where I've got everything set up. This is my battery bank. These are eight, six volt, 350 amp hour solar batteries. I've got them configured to put out 24 volts. My inverter is a 24 volt, 3000 watt inverter. And my charge controller is a 24 volt or 12 volt inverter and that's very important when you're sizing your system all, all of your stuff has to be either 12 volt or 24 volt you can also set up a uh, 48 volt system these are my breakers uh, anytime you want to turn off the power coming in from the panels push the little red button on there and that breaks that it goes up to a fuse, 100 amp fuse, and then it's got a, um, goes from there into a diode blocker, out of there into my charge controller, and back out down to another breaker that goes to my battery bank. And uh, it's real important that you uh, have these breakers. If you just click that little old breaker it turns off the power to your uh, charge controller <coughs> excuse me and um, you want to turn this one off too I anytime you're working on your uh, battery bank or anything uh, you don't want any power coming in uh, to your system flick that back on your <coughs> excuse me ready to go well, this charge controller tells you the status of your battery bank at any time and uh, that little it's got a little br blinking green light when that light turns solid green that means that your battery bank is fully charged and it won't be but about five or ten minutes and there'll, there's a red light underneath that right here that red light will come on <clears throat> and that tells you that that charge controller is dumping power it it's, has stopped putting power into your battery bank and that's what that charge controller is for it um, uh, keeps from overcharging your batteries now you can get a heater or a water heater uh, which will you can hook to that and it'll dump that power over and uh, heat your water or heat whatever room you've got that heater in but uh, I don't let this thing dump any power because uh, we don't want to dump any power out in the atmosphere we want to use all the free power we can get so I've got my refrigerator and my freezer hooked to this solar system right now and uh, it'll run them 24 hours a day no problem uh, this little diode blocker this is to keep your um, battery bank from discharging at night uh, your solar panels will actually drain your battery bank all the power you've accumulated during the day it'll drain it out out in the atmosphere and so this little diode blocker it only lets power come in one way it'll only let it come in it won't let it go back out and uh, 
that little dial blocker gets hot. And so I got I took a little fan out of a computer out of a um, it was a um, power supply of an old computer. It's 12 volt. Uh, I hooked it up with on and off switch and uh, in daytime when it's real bright and sunny that thing gets hot I'll turn that on and it cools that down and uh, keeps your everything cool. Now this uh, this uh, charge controller is 160 amps and uh, that's a big charge controller. Your, your meter center that comes into your house is 200 amps that comes from the power company and so this thing is almost as big as, as that and uh, any charge controller that I found online that, <clears throat> that would handle 160 amps was about uh, six or seven hundred dollars and um, I think I gave a hundred and about a hundred and seventy dollars for this and uh, all the stuff that I've got here everything that I've got here came from Coleman Air um, they've got online at colemanair.us they've got all these products all the information about them um, they've got a tech guy up there and his name is Craig and uh, if you have any questions or anything you can email him he usually gets back to you in about an hour and uh, uh, they've been real good you know you can you can even call him up in the middle of the day if he's there he'll talk to you he'll answer any questions that you have any kind of technical questions or anything like that they've got many more products than than what I've got here and uh, but they're very knowledgeable and uh, this charge controller I've been happy with it it's it's done everything that they said it would do and uh, it's uh, heavy steel construction it's got uh, big connections for for large wires and uh, so if you're thinking about setting up a uh, system you need to check out colemanair.us online and uh, I'm going to do another video later on that, that shows exactly how I set this up and um, a little more technical information about it. So uh, I guess that's about it. Thank you very much for uh, watching my video.